morning children my name is milton and i'll be teaching you english literature of class 6 this is the first assignment so the first chapter is known by the name the why why girl now why is the chapter's name why why girl which i will explain in the book itself this is a story about a girl who is 10 years old and she was chasing a large snake now the teacher who used to teach in the samathi she saw this little girl chasing a snake so she goes running behind her pulls her by her plait in order to stop her from catching the snake now the snake called the cobra now you everyone know that uh, cobra is a very dangerous snake is very poisonous it can even kill a person but we should not try all this at home okay once she was caught and she was stopped the teacher told her no more in a no don't do it don't catch the snake the teacher told her it's not a rat snake or a grass snake it's a cobra which i tried to catch then the girl says why shouldn't i catch a cobra why should you teacher ask a question to the student we eat snakes you know now the moina she was from a very poor family so in her family the people used to eat snakes they used to cook up snake and they used to eat it they used to chop up the head the tail and the center part of the snake used to come as eat as a meat so what the teacher does she drives moina away from the snake to the samathi office now moina's mother used to work in the samathi office and she used to weave baskets now people as they were very poor and ladies in the family they used to also work it's not only the men's who were working it's also the ladies so her mother used to weave baskets in the samathi and once they finished weaving the baskets they used to sell those basket in the man, in the market and once the they used to get an income from there then they used to support the family then the teacher called moina and said come i said to moina come and rest a little while why the again the question came up why should i aren't you tired I, the teacher asked moina moina said no and she shook her head vigorously who will bring the goats home this was the answer from moina and collect firewood and fetch water and lay traps for the birds came the question one after another moina don't forget to thank the babu now babu was a title used to respect men especially educated ones to rich family members so she used to basically work for the babu doing all the odd jobs like taking care of the cattle grazing cattle cleaning sweeping all that type of work now in return the babu was whatever left over they used to have like rice vegetables cooked vegetables they used to give it to these poor people so that they can also have a good meal so that's why khiri moina mother she told moina to thank the babu but as moina was obstinate and she would not give in to any of her mother's words she replied back to her mother why shouldn't i moina said don't i sweep the cow shed and a thousand jobs for him does he ever thank me why should i am saying this moira ran off so moira did not want to thank the babu for what he did for the family he sighed and shook her head never seen a child like this all she keeps saying is why no wonder the postmaster of the village named moira has a why why girl because she used to ask too many questions So I'll end the chapter at the moment, and I will explain the rest in the next session.
So this much of the chapter I will send you all a picture so you all can read through it and can understand exactly what type of girl Moena was. And don't forget to learn these few word meanings which I have provided you with. Because when you come back, I want to see these copies done in your English copy. Thank you very much and please study hard.